Hello friends, I am videotaping the squaring chains with all the tickets already on. This is what it looks like when they're all finished. So here, I'm gonna show you how we do this, okay? So I'm gonna take these away. Okay, so this bead chain <laughs> is our one bead chain. It is one times one. And the answer is one. This bead chain is our two bead squaring chain. It is two times two, and that makes four. Do you see this ticket is slightly bigger than this ticket? That shows that it's the square. This bead chain, again, is this is skip counting. So this bead chain is one, two, three, three. Can you see the three? Four, five, six, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. If we skip count, we go like this, three, six, nine. Now the fun part is if you, if you fold it up, it's a square. You see that? And it really is a square. I can show you by superimposing this square on top. See, it's a square. Here's our four bead chain. If we skip count, it's four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 16, counting by fours, 4, 8, 12, 16, and we can fold it up, and we can show that it makes a square. Is it a square? It is. It's a square. Here's our five chain. Again, the tickets are already on there, but it's to make this not be so long. <laughs> this will be a very long video if I show you exactly the way I would show the children. So this, we would count one, two, three, four, five, and place a five there. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's my ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 25. So if we were to skip count, we would say 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. And that makes a square. Because 5 times 5 is 25. This is our 6 chain. If we count by sixes, we would count like this. Six, 12, 18, 24, 30, and 36. Because six, six times is 36. This is our seven chain. Counting by sevens, seven, 14, 21, 28, 35, 42, 49. Here is our eight chain. Eight, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56 and 64. Oops, I forgot to put our square. There's our square. And here's our eight square. Eight times eight, it's 64. Here is our nine chain. 
9, 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, 72, 81. Let's ignore this. I couldn't find my 9 by 9, so I'm using the 9 times 10 <laughs> squaring chain. And here is our square, our 9 by 9 square. It equals 81. This is the 100 chain. The 100 chain, I, if you notice, the tickets are three different colors. We've got green, blue, and red. Hmm, what do we know that is green, blue, and red? Oh, units are green, all the tens are blue, and when we get to the end, 100 is red, because hundreds are red. <clears throat> we count all the beads on the first, the first 10 bar. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, <gasps> Now we're in the 10 family. Then we can skip count. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. If we folded this whole chain up, it would look like this. It would be a square because 10 times 10 is a square. These are all the squares of the numbers 1 through 10. In your file, you have a squaring chain booklet. I would like you to print that out. I would like you to color in all the beads and write in all the multiples. Okay? It's good for your brain. Have fun doing that.